Hi, this is Gersades, and this is Queued Up 2023. I think I've always had like an inner tiger inside of me since I was a kid. I wanted to incorporate some sort of an animal sound in my name, and so I think I came up with it back in like 2012, and I'm Gersades. What's up, Gert Squad? How y'all doing? I first got into video games when I was in middle school. I was a big Tony Hawk Pro Skater girl. And then I recently got back into video games during COVID. At the time, I was working in the beauty industry and I was hanging out with some people and they were playing a game called Among Us. I Googled it and I found people were playing it and it just seemed so cool. And I DM'd another creator, who, and I was like, if you're ever playing this game, invite me. And she did. And then as I was playing with her, people were like, you should start streaming. Ah, no! I Full disclosure, because it's just you and me, no one will see this. Um, a streamer that I had a crush on, he was like, you, sh you're, you should stream Friday night, 7 p.m. And I streamed that Friday night at 7 p.m. The rest was history. And if that was embarrassing, I don't care. I remember my first stream, I was playing a horror game. So I'm very much into scary games. Like anything that will make me scream, I'm like all about it. I'm tired of hiding. Fuck this, come at me, bro. Ah! No, 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 come at me! Don't come at me, I was joking! I was joking! I just remember people were coming in and subscribing and donating, and it was just the most insane thing because I was like, no one is gonna come to my stream. I was just floored and I think I actually cried my first stream. I was so overwhelmed with the love. So I can't afford therapy, so I usually use my community for that. They're my only support system. I value them more than anything. So I'll be like, yo, I went on a date last week. They refuse to share their food with me. Like, it's an issue. I have no sense of privacy. Um, so that's a huge part of my stream is people just want to know what's going on with me. Another part is talking about what's going on in like pop culture. Like, did you see what Kanye just did? Like, you know, like the Cheesecake Factory thing. I have no problem going to Cheesecake Factory. Just putting that out there. It's about Mercedes only. F them. I was really nervous to do this because I am so other in a lot of ways. The main thing that I get from streaming is when people tell me like I inspire them. I'm not gonna cry, this makeup is not no but yeah, there's a lot of people who are depressed and sad and they'll say stuff like, your stream was like the highlight of my day. So that's why I do it, because it sure as hell don't pay. <laughs> I did get an email or a DM one time from someone and she was talking about how she wanted to become a streamer, but she didn't feel like she could because she was a bigger woman and because she was black and you never see them on billboards, you never see us on campaigns, like it's not, and if you do, it's the same one or two people. And she was saying how like watching my stream and seeing like my being transparent, I don't have it all together. And it gave her the inspiration to know like, I'm not always gonna have it together. I'm not going to be perfect. I'm not gonna be accepted or whatever it is, but I'm still gonna do it. And like that was the mentality that I had when I started this. And so when you don't have like that role model, on one hand, it's really scary because you haven't seen it be done. But on the other hand, there's no rules. So if I can be that girly, I will be that girly. So those those messages and those DMs are really great. I'm out here, you know, for the queer girlies, for the big girlies, for the black girlies, you know, the loud girlies, the girls who wear wigs, you know, per. <laughs> Thank you so, so much, HyperX. I still don't know how I got nominated. Thank you so much for this opportunity. I will never forget it. I wanna thank my mom. I wanna give glory and blessings to God for making this possible. Uh, and most importantly, I wanna thank Girl Squad. Y'all are amazing. I love you so much. Y'all literally keep me going. Thank you.